I think this will pull it up the hill. This barely won't. I'm hitting it. All right, so we made it down to Love's. Oh, we're exactly 30 minutes behind. Hey, Billy's gonna get that filled up. We're gonna go grab some snacks and get on the road because Matt will meet him in Loa. He's not gonna be early. We'll be on time. All right, well filled up. 28 gallons of diesel later. I do not want to touch that. I want my hands smelling like diesel the rest of the day. All right, let's get out of here. All right, so we're probably about 10, maybe 15 miles out of Loa. Matt just called me to give us an update. He's five miles out of Loa, and our meetup spot is the first best store to stop at. All right, we found him. <laughs> now this is the unit. This is Whiskers. Well, Whiskers isn't pretty. Bombay is. You've yeah. got the uh, all season tracks too. Is that what those are? Yeah. It does really, really nice slideways turning yeah. on the asphalt. Man, I can't believe you guys got Bombi done so fast. That would have taken me 30 videos. It's not done. It ain't done. <laughs> we have 28 videos Come here. to go. Oh, I'm gonna show you something okay. you understand. 28 more videos. Oh yeah, derby car style. <laughs> There's nothing wrong with that. Twist and touch right there. Seems legit to me. I'm really jealous of your tracks. I've already popped two tires. See how this has like a thousand hammer marks? Mm -hmm. This was hexagoned, just like it, it almost looked like that. Is that hole rocket. there or is that foam now? No, it's this is just, it's just there. We went and got a traction supply tire. Just got a million um, and a half pounds of air. You did good hammering it out to get it to hold we air. We had that thing red hot. Red anyway. hot quarter power and a bunch of welding to fix the bees. All right, so we just left the best place in town. It was Brian's Farm Service Center, something like that. They had everything you could dream of in there. We're gonna be following Matt and the crew, headed to Fish Lake somewhere. We're just gonna drive as far as we can get, and then we'll unload. We're about 6.5 miles away from the pin. Now, I'm not sure if the pin is to the vehicle or if the pin is to where we're supposed to turn. And there's also no snow. So unless we get farther up and there's snow, we don't need a snow cap. Yeah, but we have our off-season tracks on. So we can go through everything. Should we take this snowcat to the off-road games? That actually might be kind of cool. Let us know in the comments. If you're going to the off-road games and you'd like a ride in Whiskers, if we get enough people interested, we might just bring Whiskers with us. So it looks like we're about four miles out. Do you want to just break the law or do you want to unload here? Because the road is closed. Breaking the law, breaking the law. I knew that was coming. <laughs> <laughs> I'm okay with whatever. I didn't see the sign. So we're gonna go until we get enough snow that we can unload them. Right now, there's a drizzle. Just one side of the road's closed. Yeah. The only thing that concerns me is, well, actually, I'm not even concerned. We have two recovery vehicles with it. Tow truck gets stuck. We got Matt. We have the off-road recovery crew here to get us out. It wouldn't be the first time that Whiskers had to pull this tow truck. That's true, and for all the internet commenters, okay, we're not breaking the law. We are registered and certified tow companies going to recover a vehicle. So unfortunately, we had to go around the road close sign, but we're doing it in the name of recovery. Is that a real thing? We had to go up the Pinchot Trail, and we took our razor of it, and ATVs aren't allowed to go up it. Okay. Okay. Did you do that on purpose? I think he is. Yeah, we're not. We're not gonna do that. We're gonna leave the fish tailing to Bombi. Yeah. He's like, nah, 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 my snowcat goes fifty thousand miles an hour. Oh, look at that. There's some lawbreakers. Calling Rabbi Layton. Calling Rabbi Layton. Here's that. Rabbi so you guys can contact copy. us. Thank you. How does this work? You have to say over, over. Over and out. So here's the thing. I'm not seeing the, the amount of snow that I was promised by the customer. Here's the thing. If we drive to it, at least our snowcats got to hang out. That is true. <laughs> You're supposed to say over, over. That is true, over. You know what would make this even funner? We have some Hollyland headsets. We should put headsets and have these. You're full of good ideas today, over. I oh, don't think there's enough snow. But you know what? It's a good opportunity to go, hey, oh my gosh, they're gonna wreck! Oh no! Oh my god. Calm down, you're scaring me! Over. Over. 
I'm flat on the floor. This might be the end of the road for me. Don't slow down. I am not slowing down. <laughs> hey, why are you slowing down? If you look in your rear view mirror, you will see absolute disappointment with my tow truck getting stuck. Over. <laughs> why are you slowing down? I would like to retract my I'm getting stuck statement. We are not stuck. We are treading through the snow. Oh my God. Best decision Matt's made all day. Come on, Betsy. You can do it. All right, I'm pulling over. Well, I let off the gas and that was a bad idea. I'm gonna have to do a reverse seat donut or something. You could probably park in the road, the road's closed. Oh yeah, it's true. Okay, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna ski diddle down okay. past him. Get Don't worry about go. us. We're just going past you real quick. Maybe. <laughs> no, we're stuck. Real quick, eh? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, real quick, like. We'll go ahead and park her here. I believe that's the end of the line for us. Love you, tiny. We're racing. Oh, we're racing. Well, I better, oh, I better pop it in the old gear. We already won, man. Yeah. I gotta turn the NOS on. Be prepared to be humiliated. <laughs> You're right. Over. We should have test. We should test our top speed. Uh, yeah. What's our top? To Twenty miles an hour for. <laughs> I'm not sure what the race was, but I feel like we won something. Is <laughs> that like deceleration? <laughs> that thing is like a missile. I dropped second gear. It's gone. Now that's what you call a race. We're gonna go find the suburban now. Well, this is my first time riding in whiskers. Yeah. I think I can get used to this. Pretty comfy. Yeah, 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 comfy it is. Right? We don't have a heater hooked yeah, up yeah, or windshield wipers yeah. or anything yeah. in the bobby. Plastics burn it. Something. Where are we melting at? You want to hook this battery? Oh, yeah, burn I see it. it. It's right there. What do you got? You need. Hold on. What do you need? <laughs> <laughs> oh, how fun. Just pull the cable off for a second. Yeah. Somebody want to contact Matt here? Matt, we got some wires melting, so <laughs> we have an issue. We're stuck. What's the issue? Uh, fire. Fire. <laughs> no, we're, we're in the pre-fire stages. Everybody calm we're down. Smoldering. Wait, do we have a fire right, extinguisher in here? We have a fire, fire extinguisher. <laughs> we need a fire. <laughs> hey, well, at least, uh, at least we're all here. That's what matters. And I found a giant thing of toffee. Ooh. Um, just stealing no, that? I think they were fair game. <laughs> <laughs> we're not gonna all fit in the other bobby. <laughs> <You're right. laughs> oh my gosh, that thing's moving. How dumb. We're not dead yet. Right. But this wire right here got smoking hot. What wire does it? What does it go to? It's the main power feed. Uh -huh. We think that we think the alternator's overcharging, or not charging. You unhook the battery and it dies. Oh, so it's not charging. But then it's, I think it's pulling too much. See right here, it just got hot. Yeah. So we, we you know, we, we stopped before we had a fire. Okay. Why don't we just load everybody up at the bomb and go? <laughs> I agree. I think it's a great idea. And then we can mother this one back. Yeah. I cool. think it, I think it's a terrible idea, but I think it's our only idea. <laughs> it's our only, it's our only we'll, have, we'll have fun either way. What's the most people you've put in and on Bombi? Oh, I think today we're going to break whatever record it was. We should put a bar up here to, like a ride, you have like you bring it down in your lap. Bar. Like, please keep your arms and legs inside okay. the ride at all times. We time. can fit four people on the back seat, and we can fit one in the back. front where there's no seat. And then the rest on the back. Well, let's load up. So we, something started to melt on Whiskers, hey, so we're just stopping before wow. we started the fire because we want to be able to come back and at least turn it around so we can get it down and get it back on the truck before we have any catastrophic failures. Okay. This is riding. So you fall off, you're okay. I got good. riding Whiskers for like you're five no minutes. Time. Now I gotta ride the back of Bombi for the rest we're of the good. trip. We were so afraid of missing out on Bombi's first, about third snow recovery. Yeah. <laughs> Are we all ready? We're ready. That's the brakes. That's the rocket ship. <laughs> yeah. Oh, 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 oh,
Oh, no. Mill Meadow is the one we just passed. So what Matt just said, he said? Three, four miles. Three, four five. miles past the, where we were broke down in whiskers. So we're going. How many times have you hit your head on these? Oh my goodness. I'm like, boom, boom, boom. <laughs> yeah, those bars that took, oh my gosh. Yeah, you're having to duck. No, yeah. yeah. We've hit a couple of bumps. We, <laughs> we, we just front seated because I pitched Hefe into the front of this on oh, the last no. job. <laughs> I like the no front seat. It's actually kind of cool. You should just put somebody on a on a pallet. Whoever sits there just has to stare at Matt the whole time. <laughs> Is everyone good? Well, if you're not good, sorry. <laughs> It's the rub rail. It's not a big deal. That was there. Have you seen those like RC tracks where the metal like touches and they go around? Put this on the rub rail. Dude, what should we do? Just try to power through that. Get a little speed. The reverse was working. Let's winch. Let's winch over yeah. to a tree. Okay. So this is recovery number one. Yeah. <laughs> oh, God. We're way overloaded. I think that's where this, those guardrails come in handy. Oh the, yeah, that kept us out of the tree. No, no, Probably keep some tension on that yep. way. I run it in for a second. I just want to show you guys how many people are fitting into this. Two. Level overload. Yes. I'm a beginner. I'm just a beginner. <laughs> I know that one. Eight. Got no Nine. to overload. And make ten. So, unfortunately, we all overloaded Bombi with weight. If Whiskers wouldn't have failed us, this wouldn't have happened. So, Whiskers, it's your fault. Are you kidding me? <laughs> She's groaning. You're going to just have to hit it. Hi! He better back up. There's ten of us! <laughs> oh, yes! Yes! Oh, oh, yes. Well, guys, on a plus note, once we get to the Suburban, we all can have a comfy seat. Oh, yeah. Oh, I guess that, that is true. All six of us are going to be in the Suburban. Are you cold? No. Are you wet? No. <laughs> That's an understatement. We're training to be Eskimos. Yeah, pretty much. So I think there's more snow on you guys than there is on the ground. I think so. Yeah, yeah. ask and you shall receive, I guess. I don't know. Are we broken? Yeah. Oh, this is going to be work. So we made it to the Suburban. Yeah. We're going to figure out how to get this thing out of here. Actually, we are not going to figure anything out. Matt is here to recover it. Well, we're going to figure out we are here how to, to fix assist. our snow pad. I know exactly what's wrong. I that wire, it. I sized it up, but I just think the gauge wire is a little bit too small. We thought we sized it up correctly, and I think with the alternator doing weird stuff, it just got a little hot. We'll get it home. We'll get it fixed. It'll be no big deal. I tracked Canna and would have made it up here. So, She's right, correct. All right, so me and Hillbilly's job is we are going to get the hood open and figure out getting this thing started. So supposedly the power steering pump is off. Here, Robbie, grab that. Well, bye. See the belt? Belt's right there. Power steering pump is still. Why don't we put their belt back on? Let's do it. Let me grab that rope for you, Tom. Power steering pump is not off. Do you guys have any tools on the? Just grab the yeah. belt and pull it up on the pulley. Well, that's why I brought you. Wait, didn't you bring your pelican? <laughs> Somebody's got jokes with her. Let's hurry and assess. I think really all they did was lose the belt. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we go hey, Jake, can you around, get you back, back side here. So they I think what they were having trouble with is getting it around the fan. Oh no. No, oh, it was yeah, on the bottom yeah. pulley. Yep. Okay, on. Okay, go back side on the water pump. I'll go around power steering. Oh, power steering broke. Okay, so yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's get it on. That'll at least give us like a few minutes of being able to do something. Yeah, that's not gonna last long. 
but it might last a second. How's it looking in here? Uh, not, not promising. Power steering pump is broken. Right. So we're just gonna put the belt on for a minute. We we won't need it once we turn it around. It's all downhill, isn't it? Well, let's see if it starts. Keep your hands and feet clear of the belt when it flies off. Yeah. If it needs power, we got a jump bot. <laughs> yeah, that pulley's binding stalled. Yeah. That pulley's binding the belt. Yeah, the okay. So let's just take the belt off and run it without a pump. Okay. All right. No belt. Okay, go ahead and start it. Oh, hold on. No, nope, don't start it. <laughs> Not too late. You said start it. <laughs> Pass. Okay. He doesn't need that hand. Shut that hood. Okay, start it up. Just put it in reverse. We're going to see if we can, can pop we you out of here. Of this? Okay. I want all the strong boys on the front pushing. You're pushing. So I left my muscles at home. Oh. 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 Picked me up and brought me right <laughs> back. Oh. Close. Oh. It's going to go. You going to have hydraulics? Yeah. Okay, ready? Yeah. So Matt's pulling it backwards. We've got it running for a minute. We're gonna shut it off as soon as we get it flipped around and then just muscle it out of here. So sad Whiskers isn't here. It's devastating. You got five minutes in Whiskers. I'm more mad at myself than anything. Whiskers, I think, would no, probably look. She has a lot more weight. We wouldn't have known if we wouldn't have tried it. It's true. Okay, now we know that the wiring is too small. And we won't ever do it again. At least we had someone else here with us. I do. Hey, I did say. Yeah. Was, Safety in numbers, man. Yeah. Okay, start it up. I did say, if I was to get stuck, at least the guy that I would call is here with yeah, us. Yeah, I'm in reverse. May not do anything, but it'll look good. <laughs> look, keep it going, I got it, I got it. I'm getting it. <laughs> yeah, we came here to get our workout on. That's a good look for you, Tom. You look like a snow bunny. I'm a little hot right now because all that pulling you did. <laughs> Robbie painted me one heck of a pulling machine. Hey, thanks, Robbie. The yellow it's is all strong. the engine. Paint job just adds horsepower. Yeah. Right? Seriously strong yellow. Okay. Aerodynamics. We should load a bunch of people in yes. this. I agree. Hey, all the people that were in the back, ride yeah. with me. Yeah. I got you guys. Come with yeah. me. Yeah. Well, all of you that are no. outsiders, hey, feel like you don't have a place that you belong, right here. <laughs> These are your Robert. people. Oh. I have your place. Gather up. <laughs> don't have too much fun. Yeah, we want, we're gonna go get inside Bombay where it's nice and toasty and where we feel safe. Colton and Hillbilly are gonna be in the Emotional Support Suburban with all the Emotional Support crew. <laughs> Giving her all she's got. That's it. Okay. Man, we're gonna overheat anyway. All right, shut her off. Neutral, we're down. It made it farther Imagine than Imagine that. Left stranded from a ship. Oh. Okay. Support coming. Okay, let's go attach him. So, I got child lock. In this case, I don't think it's child lock, it's Jake lock. It is. Will it just cut? I'm hoping. Well, Matt's getting hooked up and we're gonna pull this thing back like three miles. We spoke too soon when we said that there was no snow. Then whiskers broke down. Our chariot waits. This was a really nice rig when it was hey. brand new. It's got the back, back the like yeah, like this was like a top model back it in the day. Was a Mormon BMW. Yeah, big Mormon wagon. We're good. Is that pulling you down? Is that okay? Yeah, your just, window? That's good. I'm just using the BMW. There it is. Jump out, look. So you got to wait till red's done. Right. So, but is there anything we can do for the routing of our cam sensor? So it's looking like we just have a bad cam sensor. So Tom, Tom. Yes. Moral of the story is carry an extra cam shaft positioning sensor with you. Extra cam shaft position sensor would be a good thing. So we've been discussing it, and if something happens with the Bombi, which it's not going to, well, it's not going to. Everything's great. Um, we could hoof it back three miles and rewire the main power wire that was yeah, melting because we shut it off before anything catastrophic happened. Well, we just ran all new lighting. So we have miles of harness we can cut out. Heavy gauge wire. But you can double and triple it up. If we had to in a pinch. We could still blue steel the battery cable. Oh, duh. That's heavy, way heavier. There we go. Yeah. <laughs> it has dual batteries, only needs one battery. We can take the main power feed wire off the tow truck. We're not done. Yeah. yeah, we have tons I, of options here. Wire, See, look on the uh, bright side. We do have jumper cables on the tow oh. truck that we could. Oh yeah, we do. Quick work. And then we can just, uh, push that tensioner pulley down. Mm -hmm. Maybe more slack. All right, hillbilly, let off on the tensioner. There's no way that works. Let's try it. It got us off the mountain. I swear okay. to you. All right. You want to start it, Colin? Start. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Start it when you say. 
Seriously, if this does it again, I'll be so happy. Never done it on serpentine belt. I've always done it on. Yeah, it's gonna spin the water pump backwards, but that's fine. Watch out, it'll flip. Oh, flip off. Hey. It's holding. Well, not anymore. Uh, Dang it. It's the knot and the knot Cut it off. it off. All I gotta say is if we get whiskers fixed and save the day, I'll be so pumped. Yeah. So pumped. It's gonna Why happen. Why are we always fixing things on top of the mountain? That's the, that's the best place too. <laughs> Look at poor Hillbilly. There's a lot of motivation on top of the mountain. Down on the bottom, he's you're the, like, ah, who cares? He says he's the hunter too. Hillbilly looks he's like a man. Oh, he even has snowshoes on. <laughs> all right, we've got a wire that we're gonna chase that has heated up all the wires around itself. So we're gonna okay. try to- Oh, it yeah. melted into a big glob and now it's coming apart. But we hope we can trace them back to where they go. I think they come over into the gauges. If all else fails, we'll hotwire this puppy. Just run on Just alternator. Run on alternator and ignition. Oh, yeah, ignition. All we gotta do is save Matt. That is goal number one. <laughs> that guy, he needs saving all the time. <laughs> I know, and we thought it was gonna be us. Couldn't be more excited. <laughs> They're really they globbing could. together. Who's showing up? Love you to show up. <laughs> All right, so some local guys came and picked us up. Well, picked Demery and Hillbilly up. They're going to save the day. They're going to run down into Loa and get a cam position sensor for Matt's snowcat, and they're going to take it to the tow truck. So thank you guys. What was your name? Cray. Cray. And Lowell. And Lowell. So Cray and Lowell are our knights in shining armor today. We're going to hot wire this. I think let's just bypass. Let's just run a hot to the coil. Do you think the S pod's causing anything? S pod is not hooked up. It's not hooked up. It hasn't been hooked up. Oh, it hasn't been hooked up at all. Okay. We're living on Mountain Dew and hopes and dreams right now, boys. So I think all we got to do is go through the resistor. We're gonna leave that unhooked because it's doing us no good. We're just gonna put this up here. Boom! 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 You unhook that red one somewhere so that it's... you can put your Deutsch connector back together to get your starter, your ignition switch. Oh, but all these others. We are... don't. Uh, yeah, why yeah, do we need yeah, the ignition yeah. switch? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me just let me have some dikes. Why do we need the ignition switch? Well, if we just unhook that wire. So here's that red one. We just cut it off. Okay, so we're gonna pop a wire out and just put it back together and see what it does without the amp meter gauge. But that is. There's a black wire coming back. Owie! That hurt. Charlie. Did you just get shot? No, I just ripped my finger open. Oh, broke it. Okay. So we got Matt's tool bag. This is gonna save the day. Right there. That's what we're after. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try to re-insulate some of the wiring. We're fairly certain that this is happening because of our alternator, for some reason, is overcharging. But we're not in a position to figure that issue out today. We're in a position to get Matt off the mountain. Dang. And uh, rut don't suck us off. <laughs> Turn oh, yeah. and go with 10? No, seriously. It's you'll impressive. Be, I know you'll be impressed. I'm impressed just you talking about it. <laughs> hey, Billy, plug me in real quick. Let's just see if we have a catastrophic failure. Whatever that wire was that we unhooked. It was important. <laughs> yeah. It's quite important. Okay, unhook it. Let's hook this wire up to where we ripped it off of. All right, I'm going to try one other thing and we'll be right back. Three eighths, please. Just taking that whole thing. Here are your tools, master. Nothing. Okay. We obviously have something more melty. Is, is that, that fuse popped? Yes, fuse is popped. Let's change a fuse. Oh, I got the fuses the in the battery bag. Okay, grab a fuse. We're gonna see if we can jump the solenoid and see if it'll do anything for us. Oh, this is, hold on, time out, time out. It's heating up or you feeling good? It's not heating up. Let's go a little way to yeah, the really If it does anything stupid, I'll shut it off. So we're getting warm. I think it's most definitely just overcharging. So this yellow wire is now getting hot. Can you see the voltage spiking on your device? Oh yeah, it's going to 16. Either unhook or cut the wire that goes to the alternator. Yeah, how long will you and run just without use an it. alternator? Ooh, quite why a don't while. We, why don't we undo that? And then let's run it for a while, and then we can hook it back up. Let it charge. Yeah, just let it. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We only made it like one minute up the road. It's already overheating. So I've unhooked the regulator. We're living on borrowed time right now. So we're just gonna go with no alternator and hopefully get to Matt, and then we'll use the jump box to get us back out. But luckily, the, it's an old carbureted motor, so it doesn't have 
Duck for electronics to oh, run. So me and Tom Tom are just talking and we got a good idea. We're gonna go in and get the Bombi now. We'll take the Bombi back to the truck, take Whiskers back out. We'll put a cam sensor in and then we'll take Bombi back in and get the Suburban. It's a win, 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 win. What could go wrong? Nothing. No way! Well, at least we're gonna meet him. Can I show him how the brakes work? No, well, no. Okay, we currently broke a brake off. We locked, welded up the front end of this thing and the thing's sitting in the side of the road over there right now. We have right. it more than halfway up the hill. I think this will pull it up the hill. This barely won't. So here's where we're at. Okay. We are on borrowed time. Our alternator's overcharging. That's what our issue was. So we have the alternator disconnected. We have 12 volts still, but we'll pull until we can't. And then we'll use the jump box to and keep we've going. we've got our jump box. Yes, that's what we'll need. Okay. Um. So is your sensor okay? It's running great now. Well, we have we just met two local kids that are, that are headed to a Napa to get another sensor. Okay. Uh, so this thing be... this thing's running good except for the front axle welded solid. It yeah. broke loose again, but not before ripping a brake caliper right off. Whoa. What do you mean a welded solid? Like gears? Yeah. yeah. Like, like not I, a brake issue like the gears welded I think solid. The side gears welded into the carrier. What happened? I think we need to run like two more inches of oil in this or more well then it sounds like we're all on borrowed time let's go <laughs> yeah. i can drive this out i've got one brake i can steer well let's just not yeah yeah but don't leave without us because we're going to need your jump box. back with you okay good perfect this just got even more interesting ah. look the plot all okay. our plans change but listen to that you guys hear whiskers we plug it in while we're sitting right also everything broke free on that thing so we can put the serpentine belt back on Serious? But now the radiator's that? leaking. How did it break free? Everything moves now. We went up the hill at 10,000 RPM. <laughs> Literally, it was like ran. Only one track was spinning, and we welded the differential together. We were like, <laughs> <laughs> it's one of the Everybody hold on. Wester's gonna do a little dance. <laughs> <laughs> Robbie's all up there steering and showing off. <laughs> yeah. look, what, look what I can yeah. do. Alright, let's go get this thing hooked well, up. You want yeah, another one up. Robbie, you came at such a perfect time that people were going to say, this is a scripted. I know. The whole thing seems so... Like, I was so... We're like flying up no. and looking, we're like, oh, they're out. I was, I was literally walking this just like... Me and him were like having heart to heart conversations about <laughs> lives and how devastating this whole thing is and and boom! It's like it all works out. Okay. Okay. Ready? Ready. I'm hitting it. You guys might as well hurry to jump in if I was you. <laughs> Get in! Come on, Colby! Run, Colby, run! You can do it! Get in, buddy! Uh, 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 I knew Whisker loved us. She's doing good. We love Whiskers. <laughs> I love Whiskers on the good days. I still love them on the bad days, too, but... She might be slow, but consistent. It. I have to back up to do it. Okay. Uh, uh, on one side. Well, we're back. We had that issue. You know how to do that? We're going to take you out and then we'll come back. So we're, is that the plan? I'm, I'm just going to follow you out. I can drive this. Oh, okay. But if something happens. So are we just going to tow this straight yeah, back in there? Right now. I think yeah. so. So let's just keep going. He'll follow us. If something happens, we'll come back. We'll come back. Yeah. I'm good. I think Whiskers fully redeemed her. I know. <laughs> Just when I thought you couldn't get any dumber, you totally redeem yourself. We're trying to keep falling out of the guardrail. Uh, 5,000 RPM. Where is that? Okay. All right, we made it to the asphalt. We're gonna we're gonna get it unhooked and go back up and find Matt. Uh, You're not used to this luxurious stuff, are you? No, we're used to not going. Dang it! Shut up! 
Climb in the back. We're gonna do some acrobatic stuff. It looks like Bombi made it back. Bang cap. All right, we made it back. So we're gonna get the tow truck turned around, make sure the tow truck is not stuck. Yeah. Overall, what a success. Everything that could go wrong went wrong. <laughs> and we still got it done. Right? Yes, we did it. We we got <laughs> Robbie got it done. Now that's called teamwork. I think when I hook to you, we'll pull you forward. Yeah, yeah. Oh, we're perfect. You don't have any hooks on the front. Well, let's winch to my side puller. We're both gonna pull each other out. Yeah. It's right, right when we're both said. stuck, who do we call? Ghostbusters. We're here and we have all the equipment to get everything unstuck, so we're just fine. Yeah. Why don't we just go grab whiskers? Yeah, yeah, let's do that. What are you I'm doing? gonna go grab whiskers. We're just gonna pull him past. Okay, you're on. He's gonna come right through here, so let's all get out of here. All right, we got one more. The tow, tow truck? truck is stuck. So let's go get the tow truck unstuck. Got to hook up the freight liner. Freight liner is iced in. All we do is sit there and spin. Whiskers is just saving the day for everybody. Yeah, Whiskers is problem child's fixing everything. As long as we can get the tow truck unstuck, we're golden. Oh, I'm a stop. Pull in. Okay. Just undrape it and I'll back up. <laughs> I'm going to stop whiskers. No. No. <laughs> nice and easy. Come back, but start cutting it. Nice and easy. Okay, now go. Hit it, hit it, hit it. Oh. <laughs> Got side pulled, and I'm pretty happy about it. Started out as a bummer, but it turned good. Perfect. Yeah. Yeah. I'm gonna pay for your fuel. You what? I'm gonna pay for oh, your fuel. I don't need that. I'm paying for you. I don't even need the two kids. All right, whenever we go out like this, we like to bring an area expert. My area expert today was Robbie Layton Nation and his crew. It worked out pretty good for us, I'd say. And this is the first time we've ever been here. <laughs> <laughs> there's so much right with the Bombi, but there, you know, obviously there's some things that we have got to address. Hey, well, look at like mine. I just spent a month rewiring it and melted it all up in five minutes. Yeah. How it goes when you're doing custom stuff. Well, when you're dumb enough to do the things nobody else will do, you're gonna have issues. Yeah, we'll get and you mark my word. <laughs> There's something in the road. Let's see what it is. Can you say, Hillbilly, find your skipers. <laughs> what is it? Max Burrito. Oh, and he was even asking everybody, <laughs> making. he was making sure everybody had it. You don't know more. Let's ask him if he's missing something. You see him. Yeah. He's missing something. Okay, we're headed to go eat. And we're gonna give him his burrito at dinner. Hey, I got a present for you, Matt. Yeah? You're gonna love it. You want to just a new one? Yeah, I'm down the road. So today was successful. Things broke, but we all left them out. So as always, we appreciate you. If you enjoyed this video, go check out this one.